a Monferno, Anorith, Nidorino. We got a reverse rare Drudagon with Proud Fang and Giga Claw. And that textured goodness behind this reverse rare is. What's cracking you two? My name's Brody and welcome to another Pokemon trading card game opening. And today we are back with part two of box number two of our Steam Siege openings that have been going down on the channel as of late. So in the last part we cracked into 12 amazing packs of Steam Siege. So be sure to go check that one out. Link in the video description. I'll probably leave it in the iCard on screen as well. But yeah, so what we did was we grabbed we grabbed like the whole side out and we shuffled it through so we still got what was that five packs left from the left hand side i think i think did we open 13 i have no clue i have absolutely no clue we must have opened 13 whatevs or is there a pack kind of hidden behind here yes there is a pack hidden behind here classic boost box tricks but yeah so we do we did open 12 so let's get that all set up at the back here and what we're going to do is we're going to get these packs here we're going to put them on top of the right hand side and we're going to shuffle these through. So the pulls are going to get completely mixed up. So if they had them packaged in any sort of way, where we're going to have like massive dry spells, that's not happening anymore. We're going to have mixed random pulls here today. Big little shuffle here. Big little. That doesn't make sense. Alrighty, so let's get our 12 packs off here. So they're all shuffled up. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. So there we go. So these packs will be in the final part. So I'll just leave them maybe off to the side here like that. And yeah, let's get cracking straight into these packs. So yeah, if you guys have not checked out part number, number 1, be sure to go check that one out. We got some amazing pulls. No spoilers from me though, no spoilers, be sure to go check that one out. But let's go. And as I said in the last video, all the codes will be, giving, uh, be, will be getting given out to you guys in celebration of the release of a new set. You guys know how it is. But let's go. So we've got a Clink, a Ponyta, a Ponyard, an Oshawott, Rufflet, Klefki, Armor Fossil Shield on, a Flaffy, a Nido Reno Reverse Uncommon with Peck and Nido Press, and a Volcanion Regular Rare. So not bad. So one of the cooler looking regular rares in the set for sure. This one and Pyro are pretty pretty cool. So yeah, not bad. But let's continue on. So talking about Volcanion, Volcanion is the next pack art. So yeah, the struggle is real. There we go. So code number two. Hopefully you guys are getting some good stuff from the codes. If you manage to scoop one up, be sure to leave the rest for others to scoop up. Because I'd love to share these around with as many people as possible. But yeah, so we got a Pawniard. We've got an Oshawott. A Rufflet. Tangela. A Krogunk. Rapidash. Special Charge. An Azumarill. A Nosepass Reverse. That one's got 70 HP with Thunder Wave. And rolling tackle and that pyro so not bad so we just went from the volcanion to the pyro so I really love this art as well that is pretty epic you got all the uh, the braviaries in the background there with a nice like little sunset it just looks really cool let me know what you guys think about that pyro art in the comment section below but yeah let's continue on so we got shiny Gardevoir shiny mega Gardevoir that one is there we go and let's go. Pack number three. So we've got a Yanma with Scout and Speed Dive. We've got an Apom, a Clauncher, a Fletchling, C Dot, Braviary, a Lampin, Clang, a Chimchar with that gear in its mouth from the machine, obviously, that Chimchar has destroyed. But that one's got Scratch and Ember. And. And Veltal Hollow. So yeah, this one's pretty, pretty cool. Let's have a look at the attacks on this one. So the art is pretty evil looking. And with all the gears and stuff, it's like Eveltal has destroyed something as well. So Chimchar has gone, yeah, I'll break this one. And Eveltal has gone, I'll break this one too. <laughs> but yeah, it's got Oblivion Wing and Darkness Blade. So Darkness Blade says Flipper Queen, 
If Tails, this Pokemon can't attack during your next turn. So that's interesting. Not bad for 100. So it's a basic. So that's pretty sweet. So let's throw that one, let's throw that one just there. And talking about Eveltor, we got the Eveltor pack art. I love, I love how that just kind of like rolls on nicely for me. But yeah, so that is Zicode. And let's go. So we've got a Meowth, that Chimchar, once again, a Nosepass, Litleo, Sneasel, Steelix Spirit Link, a Rapidash, Nuzleaf, that really like overly like generated, computer generated art, uh, Nuzleaf, a Rapidash Reverse with Rear Kick and Fire Blast, and an Armal Armaldo Regular Air with Rushing Water and Guard Claw. It's cool. Rushing Water does 40, Guard Claw does 100. Not bad. All these attacks doing 100 flat, so you got Darkless played up there on Eveltal doing 100 too. Yeah, let's go. So yeah, once again, if you guys are getting some good pulls from these codes, be sure to let me know in the comment section below. But, I'm going to spoil it here. I have felt that textured goodness once again. No spoilers, no spoilers from the last part, you guys. But yeah, be sure to go check that one out. But we got a Krogunk, a Mareep, a Litwick, Hoppip, a Monferno, Anorith, Nidorino, we got a reverse rare Drudagon with Proud Fang and Giga Claw. And that textured goodness behind this reverse rare is... A Magina EX Full Art. So this is awesome. What a crazy box. This is really like, um, uh, what do you call it? Bring back nostalgia to the first box that myself and Booster Kings did. Uh, be sure to go check out that box. Uh, link will be in the video description. But yeah, wow. What an awesome looking pull. Like I was saying, this card is amazing to get hands on with. Just ch check this out in the light. So we'll have a look at the texture here. So as you guys can see, it's got like this um, like squarey kind of texture over here. It's a little bit weird, but then over uh, Magirna itself, it's all very like personalized. And then you got that kind of squarey texture just down the bottom of the card there as well, just through there. So yeah, it's pretty cool. It, it feels pretty wild, let's be honest. But yeah. Wow, what an amazing pull. So it has the ability Mystic Heart and the attack Soul Blaster. But that is epic. That is awesome. What a crazy two parts, you guys. Part one was amazing. Part two has just kicked it up a notch as well. As well. That is that is wild. That is so wild. But there we go. There's a code for you guys. But yeah, I was I was just ripping on like in, in part one, the box one of part like box one was very standard I guess you could say it felt like these boxes the pull ratios had gone back to how they used to be in the early XY base flash fire series where you'd barely uh, be pulling any ultras but a lot of hollows but um, this box is definitely proving me wrong here today but we've got a Yanma with scout and speed dive and a gastrodon so you got the east and west sea gastrodons in that one art, in that art with sticky shot and water pulse Cool. So next up, we got the Zonius Break Pack art. That's what the back of the pack looks like. I never really looked at it, but you got like a nice little gear design down there. That's pretty cool. Never really looked at it. I've just been too, too excited to crack into these packs, as you guys would probably understand. Especially with a new set, you just get keen. Hashtag get keen and crack into these packs without any hesitations. But we've got a Rufflet, a Shellos, Clauncher, Meowth, Hoppip, Clang, a Braviary, I'm a Fossil Shield on, a Pointing Out Reverse cha uh, Charge Order, and a Hydragon Hollow. So cool. We're on a nice little streak here. I'm very, very pleased. It's got 150 HP with Cruel Fang and Dark Burn. But yeah, nice. We'll throw that one up with the Veltol and we'll keep... Just keep cracking. Just keep cracking. But let's go. Enjoy, enjoy that code. Hopefully you guys are getting some good stuff from those ones once again. Whoops, I nearly bent that card. Well, wow, that was that was close. Slipped out of my hand. General reaction is to try and save it, but I probably should have just let them fall. <laughs> but we got a Dino, a Shellos, Skiploom, a Claw, Claw Fossil Anorith, a Zwilus, a Fletchling Reverse with Peck that does 20. Very plain and simple. 
and a Kling Clang Hollow. So good thing, good thing I didn't bend that card because it was a Hollow. That was so close. But yeah, it's got 140 HP with the ability Heavy Bumper and the attack Gear Spinner. Gear Spinner says during your next turn, this Pokemon's Gear Spinner does 70 more damage before applying weakness and resistance. So cool. Not bad. Not a bad card. That looks really cool. They definitely did well with that Kling Clang Kling Clang because I haven't been very excited, I guess you could say, to see that those um, the Kling Clang in the previous expansions. But yeah, so this is the fourth to last pack of part number two. Hopefully you guys have been enjoying. If you guys have been, be sure to drop a like on the video. Support is muchly appreciated and encourages me to make these videos for you guys. And it just, I don't know, it just brings the height when you guys are keen to see this as well as myself. But yeah, we got a Drifloon, an Apom, a Mankey, Shellos, a Monferno, Anorith, a Nidorino, a reverse rare jump laugh. This very underwhelming reverse rare art, if in my opinion. Let me know what you guys think of that. And a Xerneas Hollow. Wow. So with this part, this part is just full of the hollows. Insane. Pulling hollows for days. But yeah, Xerneas, it has 130 HP with Geomancy and Rainbow Spear. Rainbow Spear should definitely be an attack in the game. That is awesome. That is pretty cool. But it says, uh, discard an energy attached to this Pokemon. So yeah, that's not bad. That's not too bad a cost for um, 100 damage. But yeah, once again, another card with 100 damage. So yeah, we got the Veltol. We got, I can't remember what else it was. Um, oh yeah, Gig Giga Claw there on the Dratagon. Just off, the, off to the side here. That one does 100 as well. So yeah, they're getting... I don't know, lazy, maybe? <laughs> just, let's just make this one 100. Oh yeah, this one 100 too. But let's continue on. we still got three more packs to go. And definitely some hype to expect from this box. Because this box has been absolutely amazing so far. So hopefully it can continue this way. But we have a Dino. A Chimchar. Rufflet. Shellos. Clauncher. A Monferno. Shieldon. Ambipom, a Joltic Reverse with Attached that does 10, and a Spirit Tomb, that Ken Sigamori Spirit Tomb art. So it's got uh, 70 HP with Nightmare and Damage Play, and yeah, you guys can tell it's a Ken Sigamori art because it, I don't know, the Spirit Tomb really stands out, and then the background's kind of just like there. I don't know if you guys can really notice that in the art, but yeah, as you guys can see just down there, the illustrator is Ken Sigamori, Su Sugimori, yeah, something like that. Props to him. He's been doing this thing for years. A lot of arts throughout the whole TCG expansion. So props to Ken for his efforts. There we go. Second to last code of the video. Hopefully we can uh, uh, finish it off with these last two packs on a high note. But we have a Fungus. A Joltik. Litwick. A Ponyta. Meryl. Pokemon Ranger. Ambipom. Nidorino. A reverse clank, that very plain and simple looking art uh, reverse clank with disorderly flip. And a Chandelure holo. <laughs> so we're back at it again with the hollows. Like what is going on you guys? We've pi we've pulled so many hollows. So yeah, they've definitely upped the pull ratio on these hollows for sure. For sure. Because you definitely think I would have pulled a regular EX by now. But yeah, it's got the ability sin uh, Sinister Selection and the attack Past Friends. But yeah, not bad. I'm not the biggest fan of this kind of like watercolor art. I really love these computer generated ones a lot better, like this Sony's here. But yeah, let me know in the comment section below what is your favorite out of two. Do you prefer the watercolors or do you prefer the computer generated ones? I'll leave my, um, my Giona just there because that looks absolutely amazing. But yeah, the final pack of part number two. So yeah, once again, if you guys have been enjoying the Steam Siege openings on the channel, be sure to drop a like down below. And let's finish off this box on a high note. Come on, we can do it. We can do it. So we have a Meowth, a Hoppip, a Nosepass, Nidoran Male, Litleo, Tangrowth, a Holucha, a Lampant, a Monferno Reverse with Scratch and Flare, and the final card from part two is a tox croak <laughs> regular rare talking about cards that i probably like the least from the set art wise 
We've got Toxic Croak, it's got 90 HP with Poison Enzyme and Poison Jab. So definitely not ending it on the highest of notes there, but what a weird part. Like, we've been pulling Hollows for days, four days, just knocking over the bog pile here. But let's have a quick recap for you guys. So let's get all these Hollows, and we'll throw Mikey in at the back, as you guys know how it is. So, we had that very underwhelming looking Jumpluff art. We've got the Dratagon Reverse Rare. We've got the Holozonius, not bad, not bad. We've got the Chandelure, Holo Rare. We've got the Kling Klang, which I think looks pretty cool. A lot of appreciation for, for that card. We've got the Hydragon, Holo Rare. Any Veltal Holo Rare, which is pretty, pretty cool. I love that art, and I love the kind of Gears theme that goes with that one. And then, of course, we've got the Magirna EX Full Art. It's got 160 HP with Mystic Heart and Soul Blaster. That, yeah. Let me know in the comment section below what you guys think of this Magiana EX. It's very pretty. Very pretty card, in my opinion. But yes, with that said, if you guys enjoyed today's part of this Box 2 Steam Siege opening, be sure to drop a like down below, and I look forward to seeing you guys in part number 3, the final part, or another one of my Pokemon trading card game openings. Thanks for watching. Peace.